Good afternoon, oil traders. It is August 31st, and it's 3.57 p.m. Eastern Time, uh, with just minutes to go in the, the trading session. And, well, it was not boring. <laughs> I thought it might be uh, boring to have to wait near the mid-46s, and uh, it actually ended up being quite, quite a day for me. Um, lots of trading, um, took a profit, and uh, positioned more bearish now um, for tomorrow. Hopefully I'm right, we'll see. I was rather aggressive and this kind of allude, I alluded to it a little bit with my thoughts about kind of adjusting my strategy. Um, so we'll see how this plays out. Um, it's not really a, a departure from my strategy, but it's just a different variation on it. And I'll get into that. Um, but anyway, as you guys know, I was a little bit frustrated uh, yesterday with all the misses um, from the volatility that we had. So my thinking was to, instead of kind of expecting $1 gaps, or not expecting, but kind of targeting $1 gaps between positions, um, I'm going to try and take smaller positions, but target smaller gaps. So it, what happened today was when we um, jumped up initially to, well, actually where we opened um, kind of at uh, 46 and a half or so, um, I realized that at 46.60 it was a pretty good size gap, 70 cents over the next short position that we have, which is also a small position at 45.90. So I entered another short position there, and then of course, of course, um, we jumped up over 47, and uh, I purchased yet again at 47.25. Um, as you know, that did not end up being the best possible price of the day, um, but for a little while at least it looked pretty good. Um, also when we hit 47.34 um, and uh, that ended up being the high of the day for quite some time, um, I decided to get out of my long position, um, which ended up actually looking pretty decent considering where we're closing, which is just above 47 right now. Um, so I sold that long position, which was Monday's long position, uh, for a profit of, where is it, 3.15%, actually I think that was 3.13%, um, and a profit of $722, uh, which you can see right here. Um, so that was a three-day, one-hour hold, um, purchased on Monday, August 28th, and sold today on the 31st. So you can find that information on uh, tradingjournal.ca, of course, as usual. Um, and uh, yeah, so I very rapidly executed those three trades. Basically, a short purchase at 46.60, another short purchase at 47.25, and then a sale of the long position from Monday, which was purchased at 46.55, and I sold it at 47.31, 30, something like that. Um, so just below the, the highs, it actually ended up being a partial um, fulfillment of the order, and I had to wait a while um, before it actually got the rest of the fill simply because I actually ended up picking just the right price on my HOU um, sell order. HOU is the ticker symbol for Horizon um, ETF, the bull ETF. Um, so yeah, really, really active day for me. Uh, nice profit. Hopefully um, we dip back down tomorrow and I can exit one or more of these short positions and repurchase the long position. Um, that would be really, really nice. If you're listening, universe, um, please and thank you. Um, but yeah, so we're closing um, at around 47.10-ish, just about 47. Um, I don't know, I, I see this as um, some weakness into the close. If we flip over to the um, seven day chart, um, and you, actually, let me take a look at the one-day intervals here. You can see that we've got quite a tail um, on the green bar. Um, I don't know. My friend uh, tells me that that's an indicator. I don't know. It is it is what it is. I guess we'll see what tomorrow holds. Um, let me know how you guys did. It was, a, it was a especially active day for me. It's more active than I think I've had in the past few months. Um, so it was exciting for that reason. Um, we'll see tomorrow if excitement translates into profits. Um, hit me up down below on the comments on YouTube or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my results, um, performance, trades, charts, etc. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check in with you guys ahead of tomorrow's Friday trading session um, at or before 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Until then, good luck. Cheers.